everybody this is Ori and I wanted to showcase what PMs need to do to follow uh, for every single project in order to get all of the requirements very clear approved and make sure our development follows these so uh, two very important things we need to do for every project are creating flows business flows how they relate to the actual company and the website and demos how the business is going to manage these features, functionalities, and integrations. So let's start a little bit with the concept. So uh, number one is order flows. So a flow really simply is something like this. It's, it's showcasing a set of actions step by step, and if certain actions happen, maybe a yes or no, the next step happens. So what we want to do is make an order flow for, uh, make a flow for orders. And so Part a, a Magento's order flows deal a lot with statuses. So status changes of an order happens when some action happens. So we first need to list out all of the types of orders, the order statuses, and what they actually do. The second thing is we need to make flows for uh, physical orders, uh, digital orders, uh, back-end orders, front-end orders, orders that are relevant to certain customers, or orders that are different from one another and the back end to showcase later on how the orders are managed and, and worked on okay uh, of course part of order flow are returns right very clear so second one is we need to make a flow if a pim if there's another third party system a product database product information management database that manages magento's um, catalog and syncs to it we need to make the flow for that if it's not in most cases, we don't have a PIM, so we don't need that, okay? Next one are the third-party system integrations. How does our system sync with third-party systems? So, for example, uh, maybe external uh, post systems or Zendesk chat or cer uh, certain uh, search engines, etc. You need to make flows to showcase when it connects to other systems and when it doesn't. Uh, next one are demos, right? All of the rest are demos. So order demos. So how does the business see the back end? How do they go to sales orders, view the order list, view the order details? How do they process orders? How does the system automatically process order? And how can you manually process orders? How do you correct an order if uh, some information, for example, an address is incorrect? How do you fix that? How do you ship manually? What is an invoice? What are returns? You have to showcase that. Uh, next one is if you do have a PIM, you have to demo how to use it. How does it sync? Uh, what is happening? Okay. And then we would like to showcase uh, how to how to manage the catalog categories and products and attributes and attribute sets. How do we manage internal integration settings? So how do you configure the ERP? How do you configure how often the stock syncs? How do you configure certain sales orders or emails? Uh, and how do you turn on testing mode and production mode and etc so these things okay uh, custom reports if the, the project has custom reports on top of Magento how do you use those reports how do you set up trade-in uh, features if that's relevant to any project how do you set up promotions cart promotions catalog promotions abandoned cart promotions gifting promotions uh, think things like that right anything relevant to the project how do you manage customers? How do you view the customer list? How do you search? How do you uh, define custom attributes for that project? Right? Some project, projects may have a customer a date of birth. Some might not have. Some might have a company business number. Uh, customer groups. Right? You want to demo the third-party integrations. How does Zendesk or Live Chat, for example, how do you use those? How do you integrate with those? Okay. Uh, how do you set up transactional emails? How do you view emails if they were sent to a customer or not? How do you resend to the customer? Okay, uh, these are all demos to show the backends, right? Resend to customers. Okay, uh, how do you manage the CMS? How do you manage the header and footer of all pages? How do you manage the banners, the sliding banners, the home page content, the FAQs, the news, uh, blocks, and store locators, and all of these features that are relevant to the project? So that's basically the idea. Hope this makes sense. Uh, we'll create more videos, more information for there, and that's it. Thank you.